Okay. So we're here with the snow push. windrows that the graders left us so the what happens is the skid steers come in and they uh, pick the edges around all the curbs and all that good stuff and they'll usually go about one wide from the curb with the bucket and the grader will come along windrow the snow up leave it in the middle and then the loader will come push it to a pile so then we'll, uh, on some sites we just push it up into a pile, other sites we have to load it out, truck it away. This is one of those sites and it kind of sucks. So there's uh, quite a few loaders here. Ugh. I'm filling in tonight on a loader. And I got the snow push because this is a gravy job. Basically just go around and wipe the job site. And our snow push, I think this is 14 foot, looks like it. And it has a rubber edge along the bottom to kind of follow the contours of the ground. It's uh, pretty handy actually. It does a pretty good job cleaning up. The graders come and scrape it right down to bare asphalt. So if you're not a fucking noob like I just did, you don't drive over the windrow generally clean them up pretty good but I just crushed it so it's gonna be packed down again a little bit probably have to scrape it a couple of times and snow push is handy I mean you can push a ton of snow but it's kind of a fine art you want to get a little down pressure on it to clean nice but not so much that you pick the front tires up off the ground and then you have no traction can't really go anywhere so you gotta kind of take decent sized bites out of it I had a little bit too much there and we use our diff lock going forward like a fucking retard here. And hopefully you can see that. I'm trying out a new camera spot in here. And a new camera. Come on. Diff lock. five graders and an army of skid steers here and an army of tandems but there is so much parking here that I don't think you can get it done in one night especially not with a rookie on a loader like me come on turn, 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 turn. as you go. It's kind of, it's 
just slot dozing with a loader. You know, you kind of make your channel and just keep pushing into it. Don't get too crazy about chasing your windrows right off the bat because you're going to leave some anyways, even with a snow push. And the more laps you just make over this, the worse you make the ice. So you see now I'm spinning, I'm not even pushing anything. So it's just getting icy. You're packing it, you're packing the snow down as you work. So. sucks when you hit it. Don't stop this loader dead in its tracks. As you've seen in other videos. see that uh, that's all the snow we pushed off the upper deck of the parking structure so the skid steers have gone up there because it's a floating slab you can't have anything heavy so I think it was a couple of 299 or 297s that were up there they push it over the edge and we're gonna load it out with the 724J Keep on cleaning up somewhere else. 